Sup everybody, Logan here, Stock Investor, aka Crypto Investor, back with another video. Today we're going over the Aerodrome Finance token. Ticker symbol is Aero, A-E-R-O. Now this token just got a brand new central exchange listing starting today, January 23rd, on a very big crypto exchange. We're going to go over the information on the Aerodrome token and how you can get it in just one second. But before we do that, just quickly, I am not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. I'm not telling you to buy this token or anything like that. This is strictly just information. Take it with a grain of salt. Always do your own research first before investing in anything, especially crypto, because crypto can be very volatile. Also, there is a ton of referral codes down there in the description box. Have a look at those. Best referral codes for the best crypto apps. You can get yourself free money, free rewards, free crypto, things like that. Just by using those referral codes down there and funding your account. It's real simple. Referral codes benefit both of us. So check them out in the description box. And let's get into this token here. So this token is on the base chain. You can find them on basescan.org. They already have 12,780 holders. They're doing very well. Uh, their official webpage, aerodrome.finance. They have 18 decimal places on this token. And there is a max total supply of 796,338,115.2 Aero tokens. Now, just today, January 23rd, uh, this morning at 9 o'clock UTC time, this token got listed on CoinEx Global. So if you're looking to get this token and you don't have a CoinEx Global account... I do have a CoinEx Global uh, referral code down there in the description box. You're welcome to use that if you like. Basically, all you'd have to do to get this token is simply go right through that CoinEx Global referral code down there. Open an account, fund your account with USDT, go into the trade section and search arrow, and then simply just buy the token. It is that easy. So Aerodrome is a VE33AMM automated market maker decentralized exchange designed to become the primary liquidity center and public product financing protocol on the base chain. Now base chain is uh, from Coinbase. If you did not know, you can, uh, I'm sure there's tons of videos I did on the uh, base chain and base chain tokens that you could uh, check out on my channel. Aerodrome Finance is a next generation AMM designed to serve uh, as BASE's central liquidity hub, combining a powerful liquidity incentive engine, vote lock governance model, and friendly user experience. So basically, you know, you would uh, lock your tokens up, and then you're involved in the DAO, the Decentralized Autonomous Organization, which is in charge of voting on proposals to vote on which direction they think that the project should go. Um, Aerodrome inherits the latest features from Velodrome V2, V2, so that's where the name Aerodrome comes from. Aerodrome NFTs vote to distribute token emissions and receive incentives and fees generated by the protocol. So it is a governance and a rewards token. Now it says the initial supply of Aero was 500 million. And what did I say it was? I can't even remember, but... Uh, it seems like it's a deflationary token because I believe it was less than that. I mean, I could go refind it, but I got rid of the page. Of course, I got rid of the page. Anyways, uh, with 450 million tokens allocated for voting a lockup, uh, which is VE arrow. So that becomes, I guess, vested arrow that would stand for or vote escrow arrow. That would be make more sense. Uh, token distribution. The... Weekly emissions will be 10 million arrow, 2% of the initial supply. The emission schedule will be divided into three stages. Number one is the takeoff phase. During the first 14 weeks, the emissions will increase at a rate of 3% per week, enabling rapid growth as the protocol activates and partners join. 
Then second phase is the cruise phase. After the 14th round, the emissions will decay at a rate of 1% per round, ensuring that the total supply inflation decreases over time and the protocol matures. And then the AeroFed. So with the emissions of each period, approximately the 70, or 67th period is planned to fall below 9 million VE Aero uh, voters will control the currency policy of Aerodrome through the AeroFed system. In each period, voters will collectively choose one of the following three options to either increase emissions by 0.01% of the total supply, which is annualized to 0.52%, or decrease emissions by 0.01% of the total supply, which is annualized 0.52%, or maintain emissions percentage of the total supply. Now the winning option will be determined by a simple majority vote in increase or decrease. If increase or decrease is chosen, the emission rate will change for the full period after the vote. The maximum emission rate will be set at 1% of the total weekly supply, annualized 52%. And the minimum emission rate will be 0.01% per week. Now, um, if you're looking for info on this token, they do have their webpage, aerodrome.finance. But over there, you can find a, a document section as well. It'll take you over to aerodrome.finance forward slash docs. Now, they give an intro on the token. There's a huge uh, token section information. Then they have tokenomics. You can click on tokenomics. Uh, it's an ERC-20 utility token for the protocol. VE Aero is ERC-721 governance token in the form of NFTs. Aero is distributed to liquidity, pro liquidity providers through emissions. And they just basically go over VE Aero about governance and all that type of stuff. And uh, yeah, then they go over the same phases and whatnot. They show the vesting periods, emission schedule, all that type of stuff. Now, there is also uh, contracts. You can check out contracts. So it looks like they may have audits on here. Uh, anyways, they have contracts on here. I can't see an audit one at face value. Maybe it's somewhere on their socials though. Now they do have tons of socials. Now they have a Twitter, which I'm gonna put in the corner of the screen here as usual, at Aerodrome FI. They also have Warcast, or warpcast.com forward slash aerodrome. They have a Discord group at aerodrome. They have a DBank account and they have a GitHub. And you ha all those are listed on their webpage. Now, their Twitter has the blue verified check mark on it. Um, they have links to the Medium articles, Discord, webpage, and base. Base's Twitter's on there as well. 21,100 Twitter followers. Go check that out. You're going to find all sorts of updates on there, just like this brand new uh, Coinex global listing that just happened today. So check out all the referral codes in the description box, especially that Coinex global one. Make sure you guys like this video. Subscribe for daily crypto videos where I go over the newest coins and tokens and what their info and utility is. And uh, leave a comment down there. Thanks for watching, everybody. Y'all have a great day out there. Peace out.